up gamers? Hey, once again, thanks again for tuning in to the Game and Rebirth DL channel. So what do we have today? Today, we're going to be updating BHBL with PSV image tools and installing Sega Pico Drive on the PlayStation Vita firmware 3.65. So what do we need? We will need PSV image tools from Silica's GitHub. We will also need VHBL installed. So check one of my previous videos. It'll show you how to install it. It's really simple with Silica's PSV image tools. We're going to download Sega Pico Drive. Check Twitter for an example emulator. I really recommend it guys. As for the installation, we're going to install PSV image tools and run easy installer to repatch our game. We're going to use Content Manager to transfer our patched game and copy our save data file to the PlayStation Vita. We will also test and see if the emulator works and if we get an error in VHBL. So links are in the description. Remember to check my Twitter guys. Enjoy gamers. So we move on to the PC. So we go to the developers GitHub. We have the PSV image tools front end version 0.32. Now he had updated this information. So we will show another video later on on how to install backup files. But for now, I'm going to be using PSV image tools, front end, Windows 64, setup.exe. So I'm going to download it. He gave us a shout out last time to Gamer Rebirth. So that's pretty cool. Cool of him. So as you guys can see, I am installing the PSV image tools, the latest one he has created, which will enable us on installing or updating VHBL. So we run the tool, we go to easy installers. Now if you already have VHBL, so we select VHBL again, we click install, and then we select our profile minus gamer reverse dl and then you're gonna select your patch game that was previously patched when you did the installation so we select patched with vhbl so you can see it's gonna do something pretty cool some modifications to the game and then we're gonna get vhbl backup created we click ok we close that out So our VHBL has been updated, our game that we are using, our base game. Remember to refresh your database, as always I do it twice. Now we're going to get the emulator example that you're going to get from my Twitter. And then we're going to go to P as Vita, P save data. And now we're going to select the profile which is minus 3.65. So then I'm going to get my Sega Genesis. Pico Drive save data. Remember to include your emulator within the save data. So as you can see, I have my emulator Pico Drive and I have my ROMs. So everything's included in that save data so that we can get everything ready to transfer to the PlayStation Vita. Always remember to refresh that database, it's really important. So I just wanted to get it out of the way. Wanted to show you guys that my system is on 3.65. There you have it guys, 3.65, latest firmware. So we launch Content Manager. We copy content. Then we're gonna select from the PC to the PlayStation system. PS Vita system. We go to applications. We go to PSP other. And then we're going to choose our game that was patched, which is minus Pet Saddle Club demo. And we select copy. And then we copy that patch and or updated game to our PlayStation Vita. Now we go again to our save data folder, PSP other. Now we have our save data information with the emulator. 
So we're going to go ahead and copy that. So now I had already transferred this. I just wanted to show you guys the example. Of course, if you already transferred it, just override it, but I already have it, so I'm not showing that example. So now we're going to launch our VHPL lovely bubble for the 3.65. Now we're gonna see if we're gonna get an error. So let's just double check. So now it's gonna do some coding. Look at that guys, it's amazing. We don't get no error just directly to the save data. He gave us a shout out to Game Reverse DL. This is pretty cool, thank you Silica. Makes our life easier. So now we select our emulator and then we're going to run it. Let's see if it works. There you go, the emulator loaded. So we're gonna select one of our games. Which game it is, I love this game. Never get bored of it so hard though I don't think I've ever passed it well I don't really have to have the time but you can see it's working pretty cool we have Sonic and Knuckles so guys if it worked hit like subscribe share with your friends as always Gamer Rebirth out